On the heels of his selfish Facebook Live debacle, Steelers star receiver Antonio Brown took to Twitter last night to apologize for his clueless, selfish actions. Of course he did. Brown wrote, first, I'd like to take this opportunity to say I'm sorry for my actions and behavior after Sunday's game. Let my emotions and genuine excitement get the best of me. And I wanted to share that moment with our fans. It was wrong of me to do and against team and NFL policy. I've apologized to Coach Tomlin and my teammates for my actions. I'm sorry to them for letting it become a distraction and something that they've had to answer questions about while preparing for a big game on Sunday. And Brown had to do this, and he had to apologize because this, I still can't believe it. We destroyed him for this Facebook Live post yesterday. Mike Tomlin and the Steelers. Riley jumped all over him yesterday, too. It was unacceptable. And today, Antonio Brown was late for media availability. He was getting a haircut, which he put on Snapchat. I mean, you can't make this up if you try. Reporters asked him if he had to deal with Facebook. His response, top secret. You can't make this up. Patriots players like Julian Edelman made the point today that this wouldn't happen in New England, and that's true. It wouldn't. We said that yesterday. But I love the way Ben Roethlisberger handled it when asked about Edelman's take today. Big Ben said, I love this. We've got our trophies out there. I've got owners that I think are the best in the business. They're family to us. And I'm sure if he talked to his owner, he would say the same thing about the Roonies. Anybody in here or in the football world or the regular world knows the Roonies and what they stand for. It's a blessing to call them a family. So, game on. And I love Ben Roethlisberger talking about Steelers history and trophies. Because, look, Tom Brady's the best quarterback in NFL history, but Roethlisberger is a first ballot Hall of Famer and supremely clutch, and he makes his living in the big spot and in the big moment. And the Steelers have won nine straight. They are absolutely, positively cooking. Longest winning streak for any team left in the playoffs. I love the Patriots' defense as we documented, but Roethlisberger and Le'Veon Bell and Antonio Brown. They're the best big three in football, bar none. And Bell has been such a stud in the second half ever since Todd Haley had the offense go through him. It's made Ben and Brown even better. I liked Ben getting a little chippy today and reminding the media elites of the Steelers history. And this year's version is peaking at the right time. But today was another example. The Pittsburgh Steelers, not as buttoned up as the New England Patriots, and that is a big deal.